If you open Excel sheet, you will find a lot of recent files on macOS. And if you open Word file, you will also find a lot of recent files here. Maybe you have girlfriend pictures here and you don't want your wife to know about it. So you can hide this one. You can clear the recent files on macOS. And I'll be describing two methods in this video. Before I created a video, here you can see that video describing one method. And in this video, I'm going to talk about two methods. One method is same, but the other one is a legit new method you can create several services to delete all these recent files so don't skip the video watch till end and you will learn a lot in the end of this video everything will be on your fingertips here i have made some notes this one you need to delete first of all plist file remember this one i have highlighted let me show you how go to your finder you need to go to your library if the library button is not here go to go option and hold option button here on your mac and you will see library button here i will make it simple i'll paste the the commands here these commands in the description you can follow and you can locate this plist file on your computer by going to library container com.microsoft powerpoint and here you can replace powerpoint with excel with microsoft word or with any other one note or one drive just need to remove let's say this is excel i'm searching for the excel and you need to remove this one with the excel and make sure you are writing this letter in capital letter if if you are writing in small letter it's not gonna search anything on your macbook now let's say i'm gonna remove this one from the excel the list of recent documents then i need to go to finder and now go to go option you can go by library container and follow the path there but i'm gonna go for the go to folder option here and here i'm gonna paste there and now i hit enter you will see this plist file it will be on your computer no matter like you are using what version you see side by side this is com.microsoft excel secure book mocks dot plist and you see there are a lot of different plist files so you need to delete this one secure bookmarks plist and it will clear all of your recents on excel if you want to follow for the microsoft word just copy this one go to your finder again go to folder here you paste the word and you will be here secure book remember to delete the secure bookmarks dot elist file all right and now i delete this file make sure you delete this file as well microsoft dot word dot plist i delete this one and now i open my microsoft there is no recent file but this method is you know you need to repeat it again maybe like after a few days you need to clear all these recents then you need to repeat but i got you covered with this script it looks messy and long but there are some scripts we have to follow these scripts to clear them each time we need because we already created for the word and now we're gonna create for the excel i'm gonna copy this command and i need to go to my finder again in the finder i need to go to applications here i need to go to utility and i will find automator app if that app is not here just go to type automator and you will find this app this is already there on your macbook double click on it and cancel and now double click go to quick action go to choose an action and here you need to select no input and in any application now in this bar you need to go and search run shell and drag this one to this place and here is written cat you just need to remove this one with this command or the script i will paste this script in the description of this video you can go check out and copy this one and do the same things once you are done you can run this command here to check if everything is okay it will show you a tick mark i have already saved this one i'm not gonna replace now you can press command and s button to save and rename this one for example clear excel recent files i have already saved this one in services here is the file what you need to do just go to excel go to this excel here and now you will see this service here i have created different services for the excel you need to just press this one you created this service this will appear here now press this one and boom there you go there is no more recent file and if i want to cancel this one excel recent done now same is the case with the word document just all the things will be same but the script will change and just drag run shell here and create a new service for example i'm gonna create from the scratch don't save all right 
open auto matter app go to quick setting go to choose and select no input and in any application here you search run shell drag this one here and now paste the command and this is for the word document microsoft word it is written here now command s or just simply go to file and save here you can rename it clear microsoft word recents i have already created this service so i'm gonna go to microsoft word again now it is already clear i open these files again to make it more clear open word and go to word and go to services and here is clear microsoft word document you hit on that it will say some errors but it's all right because of the dotm file don't worry if it can say some errors but you just quit this application and open the word file again and there will be no recent files these errors are there just make sure that you are here this command is written in this section yes there is a drawback it will ask you about dotm file and you need to replace that dotm file that is about the language it may give you some errors about the language after creating this script and clearing the reasons on your microsoft word for now there are no recent files on microsoft word but dotm file how you can fix that here is an article about dotm file this article will be in the description as well and i'll show you how you can deal with this error if that appears on your macbook it says you need to find this file and replace the other files okay Okay, let's go and say this one normal dotum this is normal one you need to delete this one and then you need to rename this one to this one all right i'm gonna delete this is another file i don't need this one as well did this one as well i don't need and now what i need to do just this one rename and uh, use dotm all right so this will become this file now you open word file and everything is okay now you can open any file it will work same like before and remember if you can't find this normal dotm file this is the library and uh, group containers and then this folder this folder and then this folder you can find it and you can also watch my other videos if your macbook is not searching files stored on your macbook then there are easy ways to index i have a recent video and in the end screen you can see how you can index your macbook if that macbook is not searching any files stored on internal or external drives or macintosh wherever you go all right so you have already fixed these issues now let me come to the real deal you created these services individually for excel and word but there is a service that is all in one you can clear all the recents no matter it's one drive your microsoft excel or powerpoint so let me go there this is the whole script i have written here this one you need to copy this script and make a new service there just go to automator app again open automator app go to quick action and choose now once again no input any application and here run shell drag this one here all right now you need to paste this command here is the service i created before clear all microsoft recent files like this is the workflow and i'll paste this one and make sure that this is stdin and zshrbash is also fine once you're done here what you need to do to clear all the files you just stay here on any of the application now go to excel here will be the service clear all microsoft office recent files whatever you named it it will be here if not here you can simply go to service again open this app like this one and with one click you will clear everything allow your application this is done we'll have some you know errors but it's gonna be all right is it will fix all of your recent files on your macbook now if you can't locate these services there is an easy way you just need to go to this path your hard drive then your username and then library and services let's say go to library and here you find services here is services here you can delete whatever you made these services you can delete them anytime so i hope you learned a lot this video was a little bit longer because uh, i wanted to teach in detail if there is any question any error just write in the comments i'll try my best to fix those errors on your mac os keep your secure folders more secure don't let others to know bye